All right. We are live. All right, can everybody hear me? All right. So people keep asking me to live stream a Seahawks game, and I keep telling them that that's just not easy for me to do. So I decided that since this was the first Husky game of the year, and I don't really know what to expect from the team to the point where I couldn't even make a pregame video because I don't know what this team is going to be looking like this year. I decided it might be fun to uh, go ahead and live stream the uh, this game. All right. So what's going on in the Pac-12 so far? Okay. Oregon won by two touchdowns. USC won. Colorado won. <clears throat> a couple games got canceled. Okay. So this stream is obviously going to be kind of long because this is a three-hour game and I plan to stream the whole thing. I have not watched any college football today. I was I spent all day up in Seattle um, at uh, Sean Kemp's uh, marijuana refinery. I got to meet Sean Kemp, so I have not watched any basketball or uh, football. When I got home, I uh, I took a nap. Carson, welcome to the chat. All right, let's see here. Carson. Yeah, right, guy. He was cool. Drop top, rubber. No drop top, I don't. But I got a bunch of stuff signed by Sean Kemp. I've met a ton of Seahawks players. I and we don't know yet. Jimmy Lake has intentionally refused to announce it. Yeah, I know who Wesley Matthews is for sure. Uh, Raphael, I've met Ricardo Lockett, Tyler Lockett, Bruce Irvin, KJ Wright, Chris Matthews, Bobby Wagner, Cassius Marsh, Frank Clark, um, Chris Warren, Steve Largent, Cortez Kennedy, Walter Jones, let me see here, Cooper Helfit, Logan Ryan, or, I'm not Logan Ryan, John Ryan, Stephen Hauschka, Thomas Rawls, Chris Carson, uh, Jermaine Effetti. I think I met Thurold Simon. I have not met Wilson, no. He's harder to get a hold of. Yeah, I am. The Ducks actually had a game where they had more rushing attempts than passing attempts. That's crazy. Tumbo, welcome.
Yeah, guys, it is like kickoffs in a few minutes, and I still don't know who our QB is. As far as I know, Jimmy Lake has refused to announce it. He wants it to be a surprise. Um, eventually, Carson, but the thing is, we don't need it to be a little better. We need it to be a lot better. No, Carson, I'm a Huskies fan. In fact, hold on one second, guys. All right. This is a Washington Huskies basketball shirt, not a football shirt, but it's the same idea. Wait. Somebody on Washington State got three turnovers in the first half? Who? Oh, Oregon fumbled twice. Okay. Wow, that must have been a really frustrating first half then. Oregon turns the ball over three times, and they still put up 43. Yeah, the Ducks won. Uh, Jackson, yeah, not having Carson tomorrow blows. I got nothing positive to say. Hey, Aaron, welcome to the chat. All right, guys, game's about to get started. I went to Seattle today. I didn't see anything too bad going down, but uh, yeah, I'm sure it's happening. All right, Ian, see you later.
I know we have this one defensive end named a Joe Tryon or something, Tryon, who's supposed to be like a big time prospect. So that's exciting. Yeah, we'll find a way to make it a good game, but winning is tough for me to see. Yeah, it's it's not great, Salwinder. Yeah, Robert, I don't understand how he almost played two weeks ago and is now and is now like weeks away, supposedly. Yeah, Ivan, but now the other team knows exactly what we have to do. Now the other team doesn't even have to pretend to be worried about the run. Uh, Jackson, I think he's back soon. Pete, I am 30. No, Marshall, I don't watch UFC. Uh, nothing's happening in Seattle drop top. Uh, Sean Kemp was at a uh, dispensary that he opened, so I went to go meet Sean Kemp. Uh, Marshall, we're not going to get Earl Thomas. Yeah, Aaron, I don't feel good about it. You know, I didn't, it, it, it's, there's actually some logic there, but if we did it every time, we would almost never get it. I think Al Alton's healthy. Marshall, Earl's got probably, Earl's probably in no condition to play football right now. Honestly, like, there's a reason why he's been hanging out in free agency for a couple months now and nobody's touched him. All right, kickoff. Beavers kicking off. We're going to see the Huskies QB in a minute. Touchback. The frustrating thing is the Rams' offense is not even that good, and I still don't think we're going to be able to stop them. Okay, Dylan Morris. Dylan Morris it is. Yeah, introverted. Game just kicked off. Okay. First play of the game is a running day. play up the middle for maybe two. So who's our starting running back this year? I don't recognize anybody on this offensive line. Okay, uh, Kamari Pleasant. I recognize the skill position players. Okay, quick little pass to the outside for five, six. We got a third and two. 
Is that Pusua? Yeah, Jackson, Josh Allen is not an MVP candidate. He had like four lackluster games in a row. Yeah, this is the first Husky game of the year. Third and two. Under center. Hand off to the fullback. And he's untouched for a five-yard gain and picks up another couple. Seven yards and a first down. we got 32 people in the stream. Thank you, everybody, for coming out tonight. Please like the stream. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Well, Master Chief, we almost never have our fullback on the field. Roll out off a of play action. Throw over the middle to the tight end, Kate Otten, for four. Interesting play design. Yeah, Jimmy Lake, handoff up the gut on second and six. He squirts through for a gain of four. There will be third and two. All right, Sal Winder, see you later. Yeah, we have a fullback on the roster, right, guy? Valor. Third and three, third and three for the Huskies. He's in the gun, three receivers to the left in a bunch. Takes the snap. He's hurried, but he gets the ball out. Screen pass to the running back for a nice little eight-yard pickup and a first down, Kamari Pleasant. Oh, I hate canker sores, introverted. That's the worst. Yeah, drop top. I did. I went to one. Hand off up the gut to Pleasant, and he picks up a couple. Dylan Morris is the QB. Fox Sports. Fox Sports one. What? All right, second and seven. Handoff up the gut, going nowhere, maybe one yard. Brings up a third and medium from the opposing 40-yard line. Crack pilot, welcome. Well, Marshall, the thing is, these players have proven they're able to play well other seasons for other teams. So I'm not really believing the players all forgot how to play football all of a sudden. Third and six in the gun, three receivers to the right. Takes the snap, looks around. He's got a little bit of time. He fires. Oh, dropped. That would have been a first down for sure. Bynum. Dropped it. It is raining, so it's not exactly the most shocking thing. Fourth and six. It's kind of a weird place on the field, but, oh, that should have been a catch. Bynum should have brought that in. Oh, he just couldn't, couldn't bring it in. Okay. Looks like the punt team's on the field. Kind of an awkward place for a punt. Ramirez, it's zip, zip. The game just started. Jackson, it's definitely more Pete's fault, but the problem is we literally cannot fire Pete. Oh, 
the ball goes over the punter's head. He's chasing it down around the 20. He manages to pick it up. He get he manages to pick it up and he kicks it right into the belly of an Oregon State player. The ball's rolling around around the 10. It's picked up inside the Oh my god. Okay. Uh, uh, uh Okay. Yeah. Touchdown, Oregon State. Were any of you guys able to understand what I just kind of went through? The punt snap went over the punter's head, and then it was rolling around, and the punter picked it up and kicked it right into the stomach of a Oregon State player, and then another player tried to pick it up, and Oregon State player finally picked it up and scored a touchdown. Okay, that's not good. I might be mad if we had expectations this season. I mean, how can I have expectations for this team? Snacks, it looks like he kind of did. Oh, Snacks, what food is it? Uh, what, what did you order? A burrito. Uh, do you have a toaster oven? All right, Nick. See you later, my man. Yeah, Aaron, not good. Um, it's going to be one of those games, maybe. Oh, you already ate it, Wes? Okay. Yeah, um, I don't know if you have the right kitchen stuff for it, but I have actually had a decent amount of luck uh, trying to reheat various items that are typically not reheatable. Like, uh, we got this, uh, I, I don't know, I can't remember what it's called, but we got this thing. We're able to use it to reheat French fries really well. Right, guy? I think the game's in Seattle. Yeah, air fryer. Yes, air fryer. I reheat French fries in an air fryer. And it works really well. Yeah, we have a hockey team, Ramirez. Snacks, are you trying to be like L.A. Beast or something? Yeah, Jackson, that video is great. Okay, so uh, not the start we wanted, but um, the start that we deserve. Kick off. Uh, 
Uh, yeah, Aaron, this like I barely care about this season. It's hard to care very much about this season when you know it's only going to be like a few games. Penn State's 0 and 4. Wow. All right, Snack. See you later, man. If you're going to be up after 11 uh, snacks, we could probably play something if you want to. It's up to you, bro. Okay, play action. He's pressured, but he gets it away, but incomplete. That was hurried a little bit, but he did have an open receiver down the field. Ramirez, it's Morris. We're starting Morris. We went with Morris, and so far... He looks okay. I don't know anything about him, Andrew. I know he's got the record for passing yards for a Washington State, for a high school Washington State. Handoff up the middle, Pleasant picks up maybe four or five. Third and five, he takes the snap, he's got time, launches it down the right side of the field, incomplete, but a flag is out. He, the receiver was being defended quite well, but looks like they're going to get the defender on P.I. <clears throat> <clears throat> the defender is not happy. Okay, he does grab him a little bit there, a little bit of contact. Can you guys hear the TV? I just turned it on just to test. Right, I don't have a problem with the I don't have a problem with the offense the Seahawks are currently running. Is the thing. All right. Ooh. Receiver handoff, he makes a man miss. Pass midfield, first down, down to the 40. Yeah, I can't show the game, by the way. I, I'm sure somebody eventually is going to ask me to start showing the game. I can't. All right, nice little, um, I don't really want to call it a trick play, but a gadget play to bite him for a pretty good gain. All right. Hand off up the gut. Ooh, a lot of room. We got a first down, 14-yard pickup on first down. 14-yard pickup to McCrew. McGrew. Ooh, hurry up offense. We are snapping the ball quickly. Another run up the gut. This one much less successful, maybe a yard and a half. Yeah, Marshall, I know top billing a little bit. Ooh, we got we caught uh, Oregon State on a twelfth man, twelve men on the field. Hello, Shay Thayer. All right, twenty-one people in the stream right now. Please like the stream if you haven't yet, and uh, if you're new to the channel, sub, subscribe. The support is appreciated. All right, first in. Five or wait, okay, I'm confused, but anyway, hand off up the gut. Ooh, inside the 10, inside the five, touchdown, McGrew. Sean McGrew, 20 yard rushing touchdown. We got a tie game if we can make the extra point. All right. I have a decent amount of confidence we're going to win this game. But um, I, I just don't think we're going to have a great season. And if we do, who cares? It's a shortened season. 
ooh, we're running some kind of trick play. On, we're going for two. Looks like we're going for two. No, they're coming back in for the extra point. All right. They were playing with the idea of doing a two-point conversion. Extra point. The kick is up, and it is good. And the score is 7-7. Seven to seven. All right, good start, guys. Well, not really, but uh, no, I don't think we're going to beat Oregon, and I don't think. Honestly, I don't know if we're going to beat the Cougars this year. So we have five games left, counting this game. So, yeah, it's not good. Hey, God loves you. Welcome to the chat. Yeah, I'm, I'm not – I don't know. Even if we go 5-0, and oh, like, who cares? It's five games. It almost suck if we went undefeated this year because we'd get nothing out of it because it's only five games. Uh, Aaron, it depends on if he's ready or not. I kind of hope we do. I'd love to get a prospect the level of Sam, a five-star recruit at QB. Maybe we can get, build a team that wins because of their QB. Uh, Captain Rex, I think unless the Huskies win every game they play by five touchdowns, we are not making the playoff. I think it's literally impossible. Yeah, the Huskies have won a national title, but college football used to be really, really dumb, and they would let teams share the national title. Uh, you have seasons where I swear to God, like six teams have a claim to the national title. It's ridiculous that they allowed that to continue for that long. They finally fixed it this year where they actually have a, you know, unifying national title, but it, it was it was a mess. All right. First offensive play of the game for Oregon State. They got the ball to 25. Play action. We got pressure. He escapes it. He's scrambling around. He takes off up the middle, picks up six, but it looks like holding is going to bring it back. Gebia. Gebia. Mm-hmm. 
That's true, Ramirez. Yeah, I know, Shervin. The recruiting has not been great. All right, pressure. He gets it away, and it's incomplete. Second and 20 coming up. Molden knocks the ball away. Okay, second and 20 from the 15. He's in the gun with three receivers and a back to his right. Takes the snap, draw play up the middle, five yard gain, tackled at the 20. Sets up third and long. All right, third and 15, he's in the gun, four receivers in a back. Let's go. All right, got some pressure. It's a screen, and it's beautifully diagnosed. Looks like either a drop or a fumble recovered by Oregon State, but either way, fourth and long, and Oregon State will be punting. Great start to the season for the defense. Now, Ramirez, I would definitely choose the Seahawks over the Huskies. The Huskies being good right now is meaningless because of the Pac-12. <clears throat> yeah, okay, that's a drop, so 4th and 15. All right, the punt is away. It's going to be caught around the 30 and returned. Makes a man miss, 35, breaks a tackle, 40. And he's up to the 42. Good field position for the next drive. Uh, Shervin, because I think even if the Huskies win the Pac-12, they're not going to make the playoff. I don't I, I'm pretty sure a five win or six win Husky team, a six and oh Husky team would not get into the playoffs. So I, I don't think it really this is not the season where I want the Huskies to be really good. Cody, I'm watching it on cable. I don't have a link. Go find a streaming site, bro. I mean, the Huskies aren't even ranked right now. Like, do you know how hard it is to go from unranked to top four in in, in six games? Well, Shervin, I mean, it'd be like if the Seahawks, for some reason this year, couldn't make the Super Bowl even if they won every game. Like, it's like, okay, cool, we're going to go 16-0 and and still not get to the Super Bowl because, for some reason, it's not the same meaning. Well, right, guy, I'm counting the Pac-12 championship that I'm assuming will happen. We have five games scheduled, and if we won all the five games, we would get to play in the Pac-12 championship. So it would be six games, in effect. That That's the way I'm looking at it. So it's five scheduled games, and if we win all five, we would play a sixth. <laughs> Shervin, 
with no. Hand off up the middle. Nice gain. Six, seven yards for McGrew. Looks like the Huskies are coming in with that rush attack. And with the weather being what it is, I don't blame them. Hey, Pascal, welcome to the chat. All right, second and three, one receiver, heavy set, no receivers now. Everybody's up on the line, handoff up the gut. First down and a whole lot more past the 40, past the 30, past the 25. Big play for McGrew, and we are crushing Oregon State on the ground right now. 26 yards for McGrew on second and short. Jacob Eason's in the NFL, Pascal. Twenty-five, hand off up the middle again to McGrew. Four yards taken down by a ball of defenders. All right, another handoff. Newton picks up two yards off tackle inside the 20, third and five. Uh, Shervin, apparently he's got the record for most passing yards for a high school QB in Washington State. But um, because of the weather, we're not really throwing the ball today at all so far. Morris. Okay, third and four. <clears throat> we are in field goal range. Four receivers tight, one back flanking the QB in the gun. Ooh, pitch play to Newton. He's got a blocker. He's got a first down inside the 15. And Washington is sticking to the ground. And uh, I can't say I mind it but it might have something to do with the fact that I don't know this QB that well. <clears throat> 118 rushing yards for Washington to open up the game. First and 10 at the 12, three receivers bunched. Handoff up the middle once again. Newton picks up two. All right, play action. He's looking for a receiver. He's got time. Slings it for a little four-yard out. Caught. It's going to be third down and four or five yards to go. Quick little dump off, a short pass to, I don't know. Who is that? Huh, Duvalle? Okay, that's a receiver I'm not familiar with. Shervin, because he wanted to retire. 
he was burnt, burnt out. Third and five, big play, buddy boy. Four receivers, and we got a timeout on the field, Washington. Okay. Uh, Sherbin, I don't think so, but he could go in like the second day. And so, so yeah, okay. <laughs> a big dog, um, they're not playing. We, we chose between a whole bunch of different QBs, and apparently this guy won. I got no problem with it. Uh, drop top, yeah, there will be. Yeah, Remedy, that punt was a bit of a mess. I don't know God loves you. I'll get one eventually. I'm not I'm not desperate. Uh no Pascal, I don't know what you're talking about. Sorry, buddy. Eason is one of the biggest disappointments of my life as a Husky fan. Dude had a ton of talent, but he didn't love football nearly enough. All right, third and five. He's in the gun. Three receivers to the right. He takes the snap. He looks, lobs it to the corner of the end zone, and it's dropped. Another drop, Ty Jones. Um, yeah, this weather is not um, this weather is not making it easy for these receivers. Yes, I did, Mr. Pringle. Uh, yeah, he. Oh yeah, yeah, that should have been a catch. Hey, Jason, welcome to the chat. <clears throat> yeah, sure. And it wasn't just Husky fans talking junk on on uh, on Herbert. Field goal is up and good. Huskies take the lead. Yeah, sure. But it, it, it's a lot to ask, man. We need a, 
We also need golf to turn the ball over a few times. Something that Josh Allen didn't do that, that if we had managed to take the ball away from Josh Allen on some of those sacks, it was, a, it would have been a completely different game. So we need turnovers. Sacks are not good enough. Sorry to say. All right. Kickoff is away and it's in the end zone for a touchback 25 yard line. Yeah, we're rooting for the Bills and Niners tomorrow. Good. Carry on. And off up the middle, he squirts through a hole and picks up maybe eight, seven or eight yards for Jefferson on first down. Yeah, sure, Evan. I'm thinking about that too. DJ Reed on the outside is not great. No, right guy, I don't. <clears throat> All right, two receivers to the left, handoff up the gut. Jefferson picks up the first down and a few yards extra. Baylor, okay, another different running back this time. First and 10, up near the 40. He's under center. He hands it off again. This time he's brought down after a two-yard gain is Baylor. Maybe three. Yeah, Demarius Randall's probably going to play a little bit tomorrow, but I don't know. Do, do, do the players matter anymore? We have bigger problems than who the players are, I feel like. All right, second and seven, QB in the gun, blitz. He's got time. He launches it over the middle. He had a receiver, but the pass was a little behind him, and it got dropped. Third and seven coming up, Musgrave, number 88, could not come up with the ball. <clears throat> yeah, he had time, and he launched it, and it was a little behind the tight end, but the tight end probably still should have caught it. Defense looks a little confused on third down. Three receivers and a bunch to the left. QB in the gun. He drops back. Five man rush. Pocket collapses and he's taken down. And the ball is out and there's a flag on the field. Huskies look like they have it. Huskies look like they have it. No signal yet. All right. Washington football. Uh, I'm assuming the flag was holding on the offense or something. Oregon State's heading to the sideline, so they're acting like the penalty is going to be on them. Okay, personal foul on the offense, hands to the face. Will be declined. Washington takes over with 13 seconds left to go in the first quarter. All right, that was a great play to get the ball out of the QB's hands. He was getting blocked, and he just stuck his hand out there and got it. That was beautiful. <clears throat> uh, Ramirez, second string at what position? Drop back, quick throw for about nine yards. 
Nice little play to Bynum to set up second and short in field goal range. All right, that takes us to the end of the first quarter. It's 10 to 7, and Washington is driving. A little bit sure of it, not a lot. High school football is a little beyond me. Oh, yeah, Geno Smith Ramirez, yeah. Uh, Iden, got to get pressure. That's the only chance we have. And we need that pressure to turn into turnovers because we can't force punts right now. This defense is not capable of it. Uh, like, yeah, if we don't get pressure tomorrow, then it's going to be gory. And maybe that'll be what it takes to get Norton out of here. But, you know, I don't even know if Norton is really the problem here. But it'll be nice for somebody to get canned. Yeah, pudding's good. Uh, Shervin, all they had was speed, I guess. My dad did, right, guy? Second and two, inside the 25. Yes, Shervin. All right, pitch play. A lot of room on the outside for McGrew. He's got a first down inside the 15. Nice little seven or eight yard pickup. McGrew had no problem picking up that first down. You're kidding me, Captain Rex. Please tell me you didn't actually sell everything you own. <clears throat> Don't worry. 
Okay. Uh, Shervin, um, you could kind of say that. He he takes it for his back. Prince, it's Washington 10, Oregon State 7. I will drop top. All right. Hand off up the gut on first down. Tons of room. And we've got a touchdown to Kamari Pleasant. 15-yard score. And Washington is on track, boys. Touch. I can't put the game on, Jack Welker. YouTube will kill me. Uh, Iden, it's going to take Wilson being pretty flawless, and he can do it. He's done it before. I've seen him do it before. Jack, if you super chat me $1,000, I will put the game on. My terms are non-negotiable. <clears throat> hey, Pascal, I probably would have bet on the Huskies in this game. I mean, I was pretty confident we were going to win this game, but it's the games coming up that I'm not so sure about. Maybe, maybe Pascal. Yeah, Snacks is playing. That is nice. Who is the greatest player? What do you mean, Paul? Greatest player alive? Greatest player active? Greatest player in what league? Greatest player in what way? You got, you got to give me more work with that, bro. Active, <clears throat> the greatest player active right now, I guess it's probably got to be Mahomes. Well, yeah, Captain Rex, we know the team is critically flawed, but we've known that the whole season, Captain Rex. I, I don't think that's telling us anything too new. All right, this kickoff will be returned and tackled short of the 20. It looks like right about at the 20. Oregon State will take over. Yeah, Alex, I streamed Yakuza 0 uh, several months ago. I streamed uh, Yakuza 0 several months ago, yeah. It's a good game. I liked it. I'll play other Yakuza games eventually.
Uh, uh, uh. Ooh, big hole. Big hole up the middle for the back, and he picks up maybe 17 or 18 yards. Nice little play. Drop top, where are you hearing that? Okay, so a uh, good little running play for Oregon, Jefferson, and uh, <clears throat> Oregon State's off to a good start. Yeah, I guess, Captain Rex, but our schedule is so soft. All right, first and 10, just shy of the 40. Hand off up the middle. Another big hole, but only a five or six yard pickup this time. <laughs> Second and three, two receivers and two tight ends. Run off tackle, big hole, lot of room down to the 40. Big gain on second down, and Oregon State is moving it. Neither team's really using a passing attack at all so far. Another handoff up the gut. No hole this time, maybe a gain of one. Oregon State close to field goal range. In the shotgun, drops back to pass, fires it for a short completion of maybe about five yards, which will bring up a third and two. Uh, I don't know how good the Aztecs are. I don't know how good the Aztecs are this year. Okay, QB hands it off up the middle. Looks like he picks up a first down. He breaks a tackle. He's got inside the 25. All right. Good play by Baylor to pick up that first. Oregon State's a chugging. Inside the 25, first down, he drops back to pass, fires a quick pass out to the left side, picks up five yards before he's knocked out of bounds. All right, second and five. Hand off up the middle, breaks a tackle inside the 10 first down. And we are getting run all over. It's 17 to seven, Brooke. All right, shotgun. First and goal in around the eight. Another handoff up the middle. This is the only play Oregon State's running. Looks like a five-yard gain. Defensive line's getting punished. All right, looks like a tr direct snap to the running back get, picks up nothing. We're going to have third and three in a minute here. Uh, Ramirez, I would definitely pound the over. Ooh, Jefferson's hurt. 
that's their best player. He ran into the pile. I don't really know what happened, but he's down and he's not getting up. Probably Miles Garrett. Probably Miles Garrett. The only thing with Miles Garrett is he's kind of a punk. Hey, Captain Rex. Uh, Brooke, uh, I think he popped it, pulled his, he looks okay, but it was like his arm got pulled out of its socket or something. Okay, third and four from the four-yard line pitch play. He's got an alley, and he's into the end zone untouched, Baylor. Oh, boy. The run defense on that drive was not not up to snuff at all. That was not a good defensive drive at all. We could not stop the run. Nobody touches Baylor. Captain Rex, no, I don't play Madden. Come on, guys. How many times do I have to say it? I don't play Madden. Madden sucks. Uh, 
Captain Rex, I'm kind of a Mavericks fan, but I wouldn't call myself really a Mavericks fan. Yeah, Hawk, I went to UW. That's cool, Hawk. Kick off to the 10. We'll be returned out to about the 24. All right. Washington offense taking over. Twenty-three yard line. All right, he drops back off play action, launches it deep down the field. He's got not got a man though. Nobody was really open on that play. Morris launched it over the middle, incomplete, and second and ten coming up. Yeah, uh, I don't think I'm ever going to buy a Madden game again, unless they make a good game worth my friggin' time. All right, screen pass to Bynum. He's got blockers. He's out to the 30, so it's going to be third and three. Yeah, Captain Rex, I will. I'll get a PS5. Third and three, big play coming up. He's in the gun. Three receivers to his right. Newton to his left. Takes the snap. He's looking around. He fires over the middle. Dropped by Pasua. Huskies receivers cannot haul these passes in. That was a first down. Oh, God. Oh, boy. That was tragic. It wasn't a perfect pass, but that's an easy catch. I'm going to get the disc version, big dog. I'm not poor. All right. Huskies punting. Another terrible snap, but the punter is able to haul it in and gets the punt away. It's going to be fair caught around the 25. Computer science. Uh, 
It's like, why? Happened. Yeah, Brooke, I'm I got Madden 16, and that's probably gonna be my last Madden ever. Right, Captain Rex, why you mean like next year? Probably not. I think he's probably going to have to move to safety now. Yeah, big dog, I saw some of that. And off up the middle, he makes a move and picks up maybe five. We are getting run all over right now. <clears throat> Another handoff up the middle. This one for a loss of one. Sets up third and seven. Okay, third and seven, he's in the gun, he drops back, he's got a bit of time, balls out, recovered by Oregon State, but that will set up fourth and long, and we're going to get a punt. That was a great play, because it was blocked pretty well, but uh, Tupola, or however you pronounce that, was able to get his hand out there to poke it away. Oh, nice, nice play, bro. Very nice play. Um, punt, there's a flag. It looks like it's false start on Oregon State. All right, punt is away. It's going to be caught near the 40 and return to the 45, the 50. He makes a move, the 40. He's got a couple men to beat, 30, 20. 
He breaks several tackles down to the 15. Huskies already in the red zone. Hello, Pack. Very nice moves from the return man. McDuffie, there we go. All right. Under center, takes the snap, hands it off up the middle. He's got a hole, the 10 tripped up near the six yard line and a flag comes in at the end of the play. Yeah, sure. And that holding that's uh, not good because now we've got first and 20 and we all know how good we are at throwing the ball right now. So, uh, that's not much. That's weak. You know, Dracu, I think you may end up winning that bet. First and 14. So that's not so bad, actually. Probably not drop top. Really, go, Pack, go. Or Pack, go, go, go. That's cool. Hand off up the middle for no gain. That penalty looms large. Second and 14, he drops back, he quickly looks to get it out, and the ball is tipped at the line. That's an incomplete pass, and it'll bring up third and long. This The offense is not playing well. That holding penalty really killed this drive. Third and 14 coming up. All right, he's in the gun, third and 14, right in the middle of the field, three receivers to the left. He looks, he fires, first down, fumbled, recovered by the receiver who fumbled it, it looked like, Nasua, but he did catch it, and it looks like they're going to give him maybe the ball half a yard short of a first down. Uh, Brooke Chaplain. I think I know who you're talking about, but he's a washout, I think. You mean Jake Brown? And Jake Brown, he doesn't have an NFL arm. I think I know who you're talking about, but he washed out. Yeah, okay, fourth and an inch for the Huskies, and they force Oregon State to burn a timeout. Yeah, this is like fourth and a foot. They should be able to pick this up, no problem. Captain Rex, no. Come on, you've been in enough of my streams to know that I don't do that. I'll do it at some point, but I'm not doing it tomorrow. I know who you're talking about, Brooke. I can't remember his name, though. But, yeah, he um, he washed out. Captain Rex, it's $1.99 a month. If you click the Join button, you'll see the pricing. Yeah, Captain Rex, you just click the Join button down below the stream, and it should be, like the pricing should come up. If 
they rule this a drop, I'm going to be very annoyed because our receivers cannot catch. Are you talking about Siler Miles? Yeah, he washed out. All right, Captain Rex, no problem. Uh, Felix, uh, they're reviewing this play to see if it was a first down or an incomplete or what. That's definitely a catch, I think, but they're trying to see if it was a first down or not. Uh, Felix, no, there was a timeout and a review, and now they're going to be going for it, I think. Yeah, I don't, how is it not crystal ball? I don't even know who else it could be. Uh, Captain Rex, I would probably play quarterback. Okay, fourth and a foot for the Huskies. Morris under center. Okay, here we go. Changing the play. Morris under center. He's trying to draw them off sides. He pulls a receiver in motion. Handoff up the middle, first down, and a yard or two more. Looks like first and goal from the three it is. All right, handoff up the middle, down to the one. He didn't get in, but half a yard short, looks like. So second and goal from the half-yard line. Okay, here we go. Second and goal from the half yard line. Hand off up the gut again, and he doesn't get in. He ran into a brick wall inside the one. Fudge. Yes, Brooke, I have. I don't think he got in, Captain Rex. I don't think he did. He should have gotten in. He had a hole, but he didn't find it. Jesus Christ. Well. QB sneak. Touchdown. He's in. Morris with his first career rushing touchdown at UW. All right. Washington takes the lead. 23 to 14. Few minutes left in the half. Oregon State will get a possession here. But that is a good drive. Jesus. Extra point is up and good down the middle. Two minutes left. Two minutes and 19 seconds left. Yeah. 
Yeah, what is it? If Carson doesn't play on Thursday, I'm going to be really worried that there's something really wrong with him that they're not telling us about. Um, I don't like cornflakes drop top. Yeah, valid Moa. He probably will a decent amount. Not having post-it blows. A drop top. I have a lot of checks. I have a lot of uh, life. I like uh, shredded wheat, frosted shredded wheat. Yeah, popcorn's amazing. Okay, kickoff is up. Looks returnable down to the two yard line. Oregon State return man gets past the 25 to 30. He's got a big return. He's tackled out past the 40. Not good kick coverage from Washington there. All right, <clears throat> up near midfield, Oregon State QB play action, fires over the middle. He's got a man, big catch, big first down, close to the 40. Uh, two minutes left, clock stops. <clears throat> First big catch of the game. Hand off up the gut. Oh, big hole. Big lean onto the outside. That's a 12-yard gain inside the 30 and a first down again, which will also stop the clock momentarily. Washington cannot stop the run. All right. Beavers. Shotgun drop back. Launches it over the middle. Wide open receiver inside the 15. He falls down as he catches it, though. That's going to stop the clock, but um, all right. This is an ugly drive. <clears throat> Oregon subbing players, Oregon State subbing some players in. He's in the gun. Ton of time left for him. Two timeouts. He drops back, fires it to the right side. Almost intercepted. There was a miscommunication there. Gordon or Goron, Gordon almost had a pick six. <laughs> yeah, sure, but that, that was a tragic one. That was a sad one. All right, second and 10, Oregon State QB in the gun. He gets blitzed. He's got time, launches it over the middle, had a touchdown, but it got dropped by the tight end. Nobody can catch the friggin' ball tonight. Uh, it was behind the receiver, but he still could have caught it. All right, go. All right, third and 10. Big play, big play. He's in the gun. Five receivers rushed by four. Launches it. Short little pass to the 10. Uh, the tackling is not great. And they're going to be a yard short of a first down. Fourth and one for Oregon State. Interesting decision here. If I were them, I would run it for sure. It's going to be very tough for them to not pick up a first down if they just run the ball here, but uh, we'll see.
Yep, fourth and one, they're going for it. He's under center. They snap it, run the ball up the middle, easy first down. We cannot stop the run at all. Two yards, first and goal for Oregon State with 54 seconds left. If they do not get a touchdown here, that would be very surprising to me because we cannot stop these runs at all. All right, he's in the gun. QB's in the gun. Four-yard line. He drops back to pass. He's looking. He fires over the middle, over everyone's head, out of bounds. Okay, here we go. Second and goal. Oregon State, they pitch it out to the right, and he walks in untouched for an easy touchdown. This Washington defense is making me sad. Oh, boy. 18 seconds left in the half. We're not going to have enough time to do shiz with it. Man, I do not understand. That play looked like it was strung out pretty well, and then suddenly there was just a hole. So, yeah, um, not great. Extra point is up and good. He better monkey Q if Chris Carson doesn't play this weekend. I don't know. Something weird's going on. Neither should you. I don't know, drop top. All right, 18 seconds left. We're going to be taking the kick off. Maybe we could return the kick for a touchdown. Kick is up. Going to be returned from the 10. Uh, nothing doing up to the 25, probably going to take a knee here. All right. Ooh, we're going to run the ball up the middle. I don't know why we wouldn't just take a knee. Ooh, decent carry for Pleasant. He's out past the 35. Uh, he's kind of fumbled it, but I think he was down. That's why you don't run that play. You just take a knee, you moron. Okay, that was really weird. I don't really know what to say about that other than uh, why wouldn't you just take a knee? But uh, time's going to run out in the half. Okay, so that's halftime, guys. Score is 24 to 21, Washington. Both teams running the ball at will. Neither team with much resistance on defense. 
Washington calling a timeout? Do they want one more play for some reason? Why? It's anybody's guess. Okay, two seconds left, and Washington's going to run one more play for some reason. Okay, we're going to run one more play for some reason. I don't like this. This is, seems like a very bad idea to me. But anyway, he takes the snap and hands it off. Okay, uh, the Jimmy Lake here is not off to a good start. Like, um, I, I don't know what to say about that. Why wouldn't you just let the time run out? If you're going to run a play, why not throw a Hail Mary? Um, I, I don't know what to say about that. Dr. Dab, it's quarantine, bro. What do you want from me? Anyway. All right, guys. So that is the end of the first half. My first half report is... Uh, 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 Not bad, but some real problems. Okay. I will be right back, guys. Uh, it's halftime. I'm going to run upstairs and take care of some stuff. And uh, we'll, uh, we'll stream the second half. But, yeah. Pretty good. Pretty good first half, I guess. Not great. All right. See you guys shortly.
Hi, I'm back. All right, guys, so um, interesting first half. I think the weather is probably impacting the game plan a little bit. We've got already got three Husky receivers with drops. Yeah, Spencer, they're out. Tomorrow is not going to be fun. Even if we win, it's not really going to be fun. If we can find a way to win with defense, then obviously, you know, we'll, we'll be thrilled about that, but – it's still not going to really be fun to watch, I don't think. Man, Baylor's one and four. How the mighty have fallen. One and five now. Yeah, Elena, it's scary to think about, that's for sure. I agree with you, Elena. It's not going to be fun. Uh, Spencer, I don't think he's going to make our defense good, but it's going to be nice to have him out there, I guess. Yeah, the Rams, the Rams defense got better without Wade Phillips, which really surprises me because I thought Wade Phillips was a big part of the reason why they were doing good.
Yeah, Alex Collins really might be the best running back we have right now. I'm not a big fan of his, but I, DJ's done nothing to impress me. Oh, Nick Chubb's going to play tomorrow. That's cool. Yeah, Elena, um, I was really excited to see Aaron Donald against Posick and Damian Lewis, but now we don't even get to see that. That's really disappointing to me. How's he going to cook? Our receivers can't catch passes. It's good, Ian. No, Raga, I have not. Isn't Matthew McConaughey in that movie? <clears throat> yeah, Lena, I mean, that's more of a play calling thing than it is a rust thing. It's good, Ian. Yeah, I, I remember reading, I remember hearing about that story, right, guy?
JS, it's 24 to 21 Huskies. Well, Kyle, the Bruce Irvin thing isn't really our fault. The, the, the Olsen thing was just stupid. Shervin, I don't know how anybody can be putting anything on this QB right now. He's barely got to throw the ball, and when he has his receivers aren't helping him. Yeah, JS, it's FS1. <clears throat> well, Sherman, you may be right, but we're running the ball so well, I'm not mad about it. <clears throat> Austin, the Pac-12 games always start late. Nothing, nothing's funny, Kyle. I just read something on Discord. Uh, Tony, where did you get minus seven and a half? I thought the line was like two touchdowns. No, I don't watch Barstool. I follow PFT Commenter on Twitter. Oh, halftime spread? No, we did not cover that. We're up by three. <clears throat> well, the Packers did lose to the Vikings. Uh, Anthony, right now I'm not liking our chance to cover because our defense can't stop them. Oh, sorry, Ian. Okay, uh, second half is about to start. Uh, Felix, top three picks to win the Super Bowl. Chiefs, Steelers, and I guess Packers would be the top three right now. Oh, 
big kick return. We made a couple men miss. He's up in midfield. Oh, boy. All right. Flag, though. What's the flag? They picked up the flag. Okay. Well, Shervin, I mean, <clears throat> that's what happens when you don't recruit well, I guess. Okay, ball up at midfield. He's in the shot. He's in the pistol. Handoff up the middle. Gain of one, maybe two. Looks like a gain of one. There we go. SMH. SMH. Second and nine coming up. <clears throat> oh, blitz. Got pressure. Get to the QB. Gets it away. Overthrown. Incomplete. Okay. Yeah, Shervin, that is true, but I don't know. I feel like we did not do a good job replenishing the talent we had three, four years ago. Okay, so that was a weird play. It got overthrown and almost intercepted, but I thought it hit the ground. <clears throat> Looks like we're going to get a replay, maybe. Yeah, that hit the ground. That's not an interception. Yeah, yeah, that's not a pick. But Ramirez, I mean, it kind of has to be Browning because he won all those games. Okay, third and nine for Oregon. Five receivers. One comes down to... Uh, flank the QB, blitz is on, dump off pass, wrapped up for no gain, maybe a yard, fourth down coming up. Great play by the defense after the special teams hung them out to dry. <clears throat> That's going to be a three and out. They tried a little screen pass to trick the defense. Defense did not bite. Hello, welcome to the chat. Okay, punt is away. Fair caught at the five-yard line. There is a flag down. Running into the kicker. Hopefully this isn't the 15-yarder.
All right. So Washington is going to take over the ball deep in their own territory. Yeah, number 55 is an idiot. That could have easily been roughing. Oh, man. Actually, he almost took the dude's leg out. He almost knocked him out for the year. <clears throat> All right. Washington's got a long way to go. Yeah, sure, and that's the thing. Like the offensive line is playing really well. <clears throat> and it, it's still like Wilson sometimes holds onto the ball too long and running backs are having issues picking up blitzes, and sometimes it also seems to be a play-calling thing, too. I'm not super down on Schottenheimer, but there are holes in what he's doing. Yeah. <clears throat> Why is this taking so long? Okay, here we go. First and 10 from the five. Morris under center, one receiver, one running back. Let's hand off up the gut. Takes it to the left and picks up two yards before he's wrapped up. Flag. I don't know what that flag was for. Uh, Shervin, you would hope so. Okay. Uh, second and eight. So I don't know what that was all about. All right. Q being the gun with four receivers. If ball is tipped at the line. Another ball gets tipped at the line of scrimmage. Another pass batted down at the line. Third down and eight. This is a big play. All right, 
third and eight, QB in the gun, four receivers, one back, takes the snap. He's got time. He's in the end zone. Fires over the middle, wide open. Number 88 brings it in past the 20 for a big first down. We needed that. Yeah, Kazen Pack. Um, <clears throat> rollouts would be nice. Move the pocket around. All right, first and 10 at the 21. Hand off up the gut from shotgun. He worms his way through a hole and picks up seven. <clears throat> Hand off up the middle, first down, and a couple yards more for uh, Corey D uh, C. Davis. All right, we're moving. You know, as much as Oregon State is killing us on the ground, they only have 97 rushing yards. We have almost double that, so. Play action. He drops back. Screen pass, dump off to a back. Picks up maybe five or six yards. <clears throat> okay, nice little check down by the QB off the play action. All right, guy, I'm pretty sure it's got to be CenturyLink. <laughs> Second and four. Hand off up the middle, dancing in the backfield, tackled for a loss of one. Uh, that was not a good play by Davis. Cam Davis, there we go. <clears throat> Third and five, four receivers, three to the bottom, three to the right. Snap, he's looking. Quick pass to Bynum for a first down pass midfield. Very nice throw, very nice catch. And the Huskies are cooking. Um, okay, he's got a lot of time off the play action, but checks it down to a back for maybe four yards on first down. Cam Davis getting a lot of burn on this drive. Second and six. Under center. In the eye. Hands it off to the fullback who crunches forward for five yards. Nice play. The fullback picks up a nice chunk of yardage. Uh, Shervin, I was in Vegas when that happened, so I wasn't really processing stuff the way that I would have processed them if I was sitting at home and watching us do it, you know? Third and one, big third and one. Quick snap, 
run up the gut, picks up three and a first down, but there's a flag. Shoot. No, Shervin, but I was busy. I like the pick a lot. I know that. What's the flag? Pleasant picked up the first down, but there is a flag. Hands to the face on the defense. That's another 15. <clears throat> That's big. That puts us in field goal range already. All right, first and 10. Ooh, reverse, wide receiver reverse. He's got a hole inside the 20, picks up seven. Picks up seven, McMillan. Uh, Kazan Pack, it's probably going to be DJ Reed. No, Shervin, if you go back and look at my draft videos before the draft last year, Metcalf was my favorite receiver of the guys I thought we could get. You can go back. I have that video still up. You have to go way back in my video archives, but you will be able to find my um, my receiver video. And I said Metcalf was my favorite. Felix, I do not watch tennis. Okay, second and three. Handoff up the gut, and it's a first down for McGrew close to the 11-yard line. Touchdown here would be big. Hello, BMX World. Welcome to the chat. First and 10 at the 11. I formation, two receivers. Handoff up the middle. Picks up maybe a yard before getting pushed back. I don't watch NASCAR, no. <clears throat> uh, Darren Selector, it, I don't think we're going to have fans this year, unfortunately. Okay, second and nine, one receiver, play action, roll out, fires it to the end zone, off the hands of Sean Wright. That was a touchdown. He was closely covered, but that was a touchdown, and he just dropped it. That was a nice throw. Could not bring it in. Uh, maybe he got interfered with. No, Sean Wright's the name of the defensive back. Excuse me. Third and nine. <clears throat> Big play. All right. QB in the gun. Four receivers. There's the snap. We got a blitz. He fires. Tipped away at the goal line. And that's going to bring up fourth down. <clears throat> Field goal is up and no good. Field goal is no good, guys. Uh, Henry, who I swear to God was our kicker like eight years ago. I don't know why he's still our kicker, but uh, that was not good. We're up by three. 
frustrating drive. I feel like Peyton Henry has been our kicker for a decade or something, man. <clears throat> See Ramirez, there's still like seven minutes left in the third quarter. We need a turnover. We need another turnover. Yeah, <clears throat> I mean, it's not like the Seahawks knew how good he was going to be. Like, the Seahawks picked LJ Collier over him. They picked Marquise Blair over him, so it's not like even they, you can't even say they knew. A handoff up the middle, big hole, and that's a 15-yard gain on first down. Oh, God, I don't like the way this game is going. We cannot stop the run at all. Nobody's getting off their blocks. <clears throat> People are not filling these running lanes. This is not going well. Uh, another good run, seven yards off tackle. No, June. There is nothing worse than people who come into YouTube streams and ask them to show you the TV screen. You guys know we can't do it. And you ask for it anyway. You guys know we get banned if we do it and you ask for it anyway. I swear to God. First down. Oregon State. Planet Fox. I, I didn't I was never gonna get one of the first PS5s. I didn't want to. I want them to work out their bugs first. Yeah, June. If you show like football games or baseball games or whatever, okay, play action. Quick little pass. Looks like a little 10-yard gain for the tight end. Yeah, it's copyright, June Bugs. Okay, I can't show the TV. Find a stream. First and 10, <clears throat> Oregon State in field goal range almost. Well, no, not really. They're across midfield, though. Okay, looks like a trick play. Wide receiver reverse. He's got a lot of room. This is trouble. Great play by number 22 to limit him to an eight-yard gain instead of much, much more. That was a phenomenal play by the defender there, McDuffie. Uh 
Okay, second and two, handoff up the middle. This one gets stuffed for no gain, and we've got a third and short coming up on the fringe of field goal range. Taimani makes a play in the backfield. <clears throat> I never watched uh, Last Chance U, JS. Third and one, handoff up the middle. He finds the hole, first down and a whole lot more, close to the 20. We cannot stop the run tonight, guys. Holy crap. Close on the 24 yard line. We got first and 10, three receivers to the right. QB drops back to pass, quickly gets it out of his hands for a little three yard, two yard completion. Might be about, looks like about three yards to Fleming's. Uh, second and seven coming up. Hey, TJ. Second and eight. QB under center. Puts a receiver in motion. Handoff up the gut. Another big hole, but yep, first down. Oh my God, this run defense is getting embarrassed. It's 24 21. We cannot stop the run tonight. Holy moly. This is bad. A minute left in the third quarter. Two receivers at the top. Heavy formation, two tight ends and a back. Another run up the gut. Another big hole. Another six-yard gain. Defensive line is getting dominated. Okay, OSU fan, I kind of picked up on that. I don't think Oregon State has that many fans, so not exactly surprising. Second and four, inside the 10. Another handoff up the gut. Tackled a yard short of the first down. And that'll take us to the end of the quarter so the defense gets an opportunity to rest for a second. But they've got a big third and one coming up. And they cannot get a stop on the ground. <clears throat> Hello, Michael Hogg. I stream pretty much every night. Um, I Sometimes I stream when I play video games. Sometimes I stream like this. But I stream pretty much every evening or night in some form or fashion. So, yeah, I, I try to stream nightly, and I make videos pretty much daily.
Uh, JS, probably, yes. I will probably jump on Dragon Quest or Killing Floor <clears throat> or Minecraft after the game. <clears throat> oh, really, Michael Hogg? Uh, Michael Hogg, no. I used to be on Twitch, but nobody would watch me, so now I stream on YouTube exclusively. Uh, I do the same things on YouTube that I used to do on Twitch, though, so it's the same difference. But thank you, Michael Hogg. Welcome to the channel. I miss Vita Vey, man. He's the best. He might be one of the he might be the greatest husky of the last twenty years. Vita Vey might be the greatest husky of the last twenty years. Hey Zario. He might be the best husky since Steve Entman, for all I know. No problem, Michael. Did you subscribe to the channel, Michael? All right, JS. Uh, Zario, my nerves are not that high up because I have low expectations. Yeah, this is becoming embarrassing. I mean, neither team can really stop the run, but, you know, I don't care about Oregon State. Figure out how to stop the run yourselves, bro. Okay, third and one from the five-yard line. Okay, here we go. You know the run play's coming. Can you stop it? Ah, uh, looks like he just barely picked up enough for a first down. I think he picked it up, but it was very close. Yeah, he picked it up. Ooh, he's short. He's short by maybe six inches. Short of the first down by maybe six inches. Fourth and an inch. Oregon State hands it off. I think he got it. It's very close, though. I think he got it. I think he got maybe half a yard and he needed a foot. First and goal it is. All right. <laughs> Didn't realize
Ooh. Oh, he didn't get it. They said he got no gain. Wow. Okay. Uh, maybe the camera angle was bad, but I did really think he got that. All right. Uh, this will probably be challenged. This is probably going to get challenged by Oregon State. If they can, I, 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 I don't know. Zylons, what are you talking about? I'm not killing nobody. I'm assuming that's going to get challenged or something. Unless the camera angle was really bad. That looked like a first down. Hmm. Uh, Michael, call me Brendan. That's fine. I play all kinds of games, Michael. I'm probably going to play Dragon Quest after this is over. It might be Minecraft, might be Killing Floor, might be uh, Dead by Daylight, might be this or that. I play all kinds of random stuff. Uh, I, I think Heward's going to be the QB next year. I play all kinds of stuff, Michael. I don't have a problem with this QB the way he's playing. I think he's playing fine, but. <clears throat> Jimmy Lake Michael Hogg Jimmy Lake Okay so I guess they didn't challenge it Or they lost the chat I don't know but I think we have the ball yeah we have the ball, so I don't really know what to say about that, except uh, we have the ball. <clears throat> All right. I formation, one receiver, two tight ends to the right, one receiver to the left. We got under center snap, handoff up the gut. Nice play by Pleasant for a 12-yard gain. Gets us out of danger. Okay, no problem, Michael. I appreciate that. All right, nice run by Pleasant. We got a lot of quality running backs on this team tonight. All right, shotgun snap. He drops back to pass. He's got all day. Fires it on the run. Nice catch by Bynum. That was dangerous, but he's across midfield. He's up to the 40. Wow, great catch and run by Bynum. That looked like it could have been a disaster, but Bynum turns it into a big, big play. 
Okay, yeah, Bynum runs over the middle, gets open, almost picked, but it gets through to Bynum. What a nice throw. What a nice run after the catch. All right, 41-yard line, first and 10, I formation with two tight ends to his left and a receiver to his right. Hand off to the fullback, and he picks up four yards. That fullback run has worked well today. We're seeing some good stuff from a fullback, West Dyer, Westover. Feel better? Uh, I, I don't know if it's raining. I don't think it is anymore. All right. Pitch play. A little bit of trickeration there. Big first down and way more. Down to the 20. Down the left sideline. Gets knocked out of bounds. All right. Cam Davis down to the 20-yard line. The flag. Uh-oh. We really can't afford these flags, kids. Come on. Looks like it's coming back. Yep. Holding. Oh, that's the only thing that can stop us. We can't get stopped on the run. The only thing that can stop us is getting called for holding penalties. Come on, guys. Knock that shiz off. Second and 16 now. Back near midfield. Shotgun snap, takes it, dumps it off, checks it down. Nice little play to get back half of it. Down the left sideline, check down to Cam Davis. He picks up eight. Third and eight coming up. Third and seven, excuse me. Third and seven, he's in the gun. <clears throat> he drops back to pass, he's looking, he slings it, gets knocked down at the line. Oh God, that holding penalty killed that drive. Another pass gets knocked down at the line of scrimmage for uh, Morris. Fourth and seven. Weird spot of the field. Punting sucks. Can't kick a field goal. Uh, going for it is brutal because you don't really have that kind of uh, offense. Michael, that icon is a member's badge. If you go, if you scroll down below the video and click the join button, you can become a member for two bucks. Ooh, we're going for it. And you can get the member badge. Okay, fourth and seven. We're going for it. Ooh. Play clock ran down, but that was a very ticky tack call. We'll delay a game. Now we might be punting it. Yeah, Michael Hogg, that icon is a member's badge. You can check the pinned uh, comment in chat as well. Okay, looks like we're going to punt now. Hmm. Okay, the punt is up. That snap was a lot better than the first two. Punt looks pretty good. Wow, it gets pinned inside the one-yard line. What a nice punt. The inside the one-yard line. Oh, really, Michael? I'm sorry to hear that, man. I'm sorry to hear that, Michael. What a
<laughs> Michael, wow, okay, that sucks, dude. Yeah, Michael, look in the video description. I have a link to my Twitter. Yeah, Michael, but look in the stream video description. You will see my Twitter account. All right, we got him pinned inside the one. Let's go. Okay, uh, run up the gut for maybe a yard or two. All right, Michael. Wait, if you're living on the streets in Seattle, penniless, how are you in my stream? <clears throat> All right, second and eight, another run up the middle. This one chopped down after a gain of four, maybe five. Third and short coming up. Uh, ten and a half minutes left is Ilon. You would hope so, Ramirez. Third and three. Third and three, QB in the gun with four receivers. Big play, big play. He takes the snap, drops back to pass, fires it over the middle for a short completion and a first down up to the 15. <clears throat> oh, okay, Michael. All right, first and 10 at the 15 for Oregon State. Play action, roll out, rolls out to his right. Looking, he fires it, overthrows his receiver, ball out of bounds. Almost picked off, actually. Second and ten. Oh, 
actually am, it's about to call you. Second and 10, drop back, quick pass over the middle, incomplete off the hands of a receiver. He was well covered. Uh, third and 10 coming up, big play. Yes, C. Ramirez, he is. Third and ten, here we go. Ooh, he almost jumped off sides but pulled himself back in time. He almost pulled a Bennett. <clears throat> All right, there's the snap. Three-man, four-man rush. We get to him, we hurry him, but he gets the ball out. Incomplete. And no flag, so that'll be a fourth down. Oregon's bringing on the punter. Good pressure, good throw, but uh, the defender, Bold, Molden, was able to get his hand in there to knock it away. Good play. Here's the punt. It's up. Looks like it's going to bounce around the 50. It's going to roll to about the 43. So Washington has good field position here. A touchdown would almost ice the game. Yeah. Yes. yes. Yeah, Ramirez, this has not been a banner game, but, uh, you know, so it is. <clears throat> the team is not a great team this year. It, it's just the reality of the situation. Shadow. Yeah, yeah, Aaron, I heard about that. Um, that's part of the reason why I got out of the house today. I needed to go do something. Because these jackasses are going to shut down my state again. I mean, not that it affects me that much, but it definitely affects a lot of people. <clears throat> like, I'm lucky it doesn't affect me that much, but uh, Ramirez, I don't know. I guess because we're good at running the ball right now. Yeah, that's true, Aaron. <clears throat> Until the people that you're ordering for run out of money. Oh, Felix, that got shut down months ago. Okay, shotgun snap, handoff up the gut for four yards, maybe five. Newton dragged a dude, <clears throat> maybe four yards. Like, my dad's business was killing it during the pandemic because his business just so happens to be perfect for work functioning 
in a pandemic, but eventually people are going to run out of money and then even he's not going to be able to survive it. So hopefully it doesn't get that bad. Second and six, false start or offsides or something. Somebody moved. I'm pretty sure it's false start, though. Yes, Felix, all three timeouts, eight and a half minutes left. So that wipes out the first down run, unfortunately. <clears throat> All right, second and 11, bunch formation kind of. Okay, another handoff up the gut. Ooh, nice play, nice run up near the first down marker. I think it's going to be third and a yard. Uh huh. Third and one QB sneak, and he's got it with a couple yards to spare. <clears throat> that was a three yard QB sneak, boys. Three yard QB sneak. We got 35 people in the stream. Uh, thank you, everybody, for coming out for this uh, season opener for the Huskies. Please like the stream if you haven't yet. Uh, if you're new to the channel, you can subscribe. And uh, yeah, we also have memberships open now if you're really interested in the content. Introverted, Washington is up by a field goal with seven minutes left, and they're driving. All right. Under center. First and ten. I formation with a single receiver up at the top. Hand off up the middle to Newton, and he drives forward for four yards. Second and six incoming. I didn't think about it. I think, I think we've done all we can here. Starting. Second and six, one receiver, I formation, two tight ends. Another handoff up the gut to Newton. He makes a man miss and squirts forward for two, maybe three. Hello, Alejandra Ramirez. Yeah, we got six minutes left. <clears throat> Five, 553 yards to go to pick up a crucial first down. If we don't pick up this first down, I'll bet we go for it. Another handoff up the gut. Newton gets two, needed three. Fourth and one incoming, and you got to believe they're going to go for it from here. If they can go forward and get it, their win probability skyrockets. <clears throat> I would be very surprised if we did anything other than go for it. Fourth and one. Offense looks like they're lining up to go for it. QB puts a receiver in motion. QB sneak. I think he got it. The ref is giving it to him pretty clearly. Looks like a two-yard gain on fourth and one. Big first down. Nothing to it. Four and a half minutes left. Couple more first downs. Salts the game away. A touchdown would probably do it too. We got an Oregon State player down, got an injury, number 97. 
I, uh, I, um, Yeah, Aaron, I know. <clears throat> and I got no beef with it because I don't trust our QB, but this is not the kind of offense that I typically like, but it is what it is. And, and, You should get Maybe we can run the ball on Oregon. Maybe we can just play keep away. All right. Alexander Skelton coming off with the injury. Right guy, what the hell did you post? Right guy, what the hell did you post? Okay, first and 10 inside the 30, around the 33. Okay, end around to Bynum. He's got a little bit of room and he breaks a tackle first down inside the 20 around the 15. Okay, Rye Guy, why did your comment get deleted by the Google moderator team? What the hell did you say? I have never had that happen in my chat before, and I've had people come in here spouting racial slurs. Maybe Oregon has the worst run defense in college football history, and like the moderators are so offended that they think you have a good run defense that they deleted it. I've never seen that before. That is weird. I didn't even know the Google moderator team would be watching my streams. Okay. Red zone possession, first and 10. Handoff up the gut to Newton. Looks like he picks up maybe three. All right. 322 left. Oh, that was weird. 
Okay. We almost have, we have 44 people in here now, by the way. Thank you, everybody, for coming out. This has been a fun stream, almost three hours, or almost three and a half hours, excuse me. Hey, Dark Sapphire, welcome to the stream. Captain Rex, I don't know if he's washed, but he is a linebacker, so I just feel like his ability to affect the game is limited. I don't think he's washed. That's not the right word, but we we shouldn't be paying him this much money. He doesn't have enough impact on the game. Uh, John, I'm not feeling very good about the game tomorrow. I got to be straight with you. Washington has 262 rushing yards. Okay, second and seven. Another trick play, but this one gets sniffed out for a big loss. It is now third down and long. That was a uh, that was a going to the well one too many times. That got sniffed out immediately. <clears throat> Dunze got tackled for a five or six yard loss there on the end around. All right, three minutes to go. A field goal does not end the game at all, so this is dangerous right here. Yeah, sure, and that's what I'm saying. We can't run the ball with these running backs. We just can't do it. Hello, Mobile Sports Serpent. Welcome to the chat. All right, Captain Rex. Uh, mobile, I'm not sure I can do that. <clears throat> I don't know very much about the Pac-12 QBs. I haven't been watching very much Pac-12 football.
uh, username. This is when I make videos, my computer's over here. When I shoot my YouTube videos, I use the green screen for my background. All right, guys, this is a big third down. What are we going to do? We're going to run it. We're going to pass it. Uh, the game is not over unless we pick up this third down. He's in the gun with four receivers and one back to his left. We, uh, flag. False start. Oh, my God. It just keeps getting worse and worse. What a mess. What a mess this sequence is. <laughs> All right, 25, 24 yard line, third and 18. Tough to imagine we get a conversion here. Snap is all right. He's got time. He's looking around. He's looking around, scrambling away from the pressure. He takes off and runs with it. Picks up. Oh, gets down to the 10 before getting slammed by a defender. But now it's fourth and four. Wow. Oh, my God. Mo Morris just got lit up. But uh, fourth and four. So now we have a short field goal. Or I guess we can go for it if we don't trust our kicker. Okay, fourth and three. We're going for it. Okay. Or we're lining up to go for it from the 10-yard line. Washington calls timeout. Okay. Uh, OSU has one timeout left. Oh, they're going to look at it for targeting. If we, if we go for it and get it, it's pretty much game over. I think Alabama will win the national championship too. Uh, Felix, if there's targeting, we would get a first down. It looked like helmet to helmet to me, but I don't know. He was a runner. He wasn't sliding or anything. Let's see. <clears throat> uh, mobile, it, it looked like helmet to helmet to me, but I'm not sure. I'm still watching commercials. I have no idea.
Well, they call targeting. Okay, they're showing a slow motion replay. Oh, yeah, that's helmet to helmet. Yeah, that's an easy. Okay, that's easy. Okay, yeah, that's targeting for sure. <clears throat> I didn't see that angle until just now, but that angle makes it pretty clear that it's helmet to helmet. All right, first and goal from the five-yard line. Two and a half minutes left, one timeout for Oregon State. They need to get a stop, force a field goal, and have a little bit of time left. Two and a half minutes. <clears throat> I'm getting raided by Bieber fans. Okay, three minutes left. They reset the clock. Okay, five yard line, eye formation, handoff, pleasant. Picks up maybe a yard. Draining a cup, draining their timeouts in the final few seconds and scoring on third or fourth down would be ideal. Second down and four yards to go for a touchdown. I don't know if the Huskers are good this year. All right, Washington lining up, jumbo set, eye formation. Hand off up the middle once again, picks forward for maybe down to the three yard line. Gets down to about the three, that's gonna take us inside of two minutes. Third and goal. <clears throat> Third and goal incoming. Huskies. Wow. Why is the ball still at the five-yard line? Okay, another handoff up the middle to Newton, and he gets stopped for maybe a yard. There is a flag down, but I don't understand why the ball just stayed at the five-yard line every play. That was weird. <laughs> The ball spots in this game have been pretty crappy. I mean, it is Pac-12 after dark, so I'm not surprised, but the uh, ball spots today have been weak. Yeah, Washington's not... Ooh. Ooh, person... Ooh. Okay, decline, so it doesn't really matter. All right, fourth down for Washington. But the flag, I think, stops the clock, which is a tragedy. But uh, now we have fourth and goal from, like, the four-yard line. So I don't know. Do you kick a field goal or do you go for it? I, I This is weird. <clears throat> I kind of don't want to kick a field goal because it can get blocked, and that's the main way you can blow the game at this point, in my opinion. I'm a little confused. Okay, Peyton Henry's on to kick a field goal. All right. All right, 23-yarder. He's right in the middle of the field. This should be a chippy. And he kicks it through. He kicks it through. 
<clears throat> All right, six point game with a buck forty five left. Oregon State will have a chance, but they got no timeouts and limited time. <laughs> the monsters of fake moments. Yeah, Captain Rex, I've had that happen a couple times. I've had that happen a couple times, yeah. <clears throat> uh, big dog, uh, probably do another call in stream or something. Mr. DJ David, welcome to the chat. All right. All right. Kickoff coming. Let's get some better kick coverage on this one, please. Well, Aaron, I don't think running the ball a lot with this team is a bad idea. I mean, you saw our receivers can't catch a cold. He's going to take it out from a yard deep in the end zone, and he's going to get wrapped up at the 20. Great kick coverage. <clears throat> Paige, are you actually a girl, or do you pretend to be a girl online to get attention? Be honest. All right, first and 10 from the 21. QB in the gun with four receivers in her back. Takes the snap, three-man rush. Quick check down for maybe 10 yards. Not a bad little play. It is enough for the first down, which will temporarily stop the clock. All right, another three-man rush. Another check down. This one much less successful, maybe a four-yard gain. That's going to keep the clock moving. All right. Up to the 36-yard line. Another three-man rush. QB is flushed. He almost throws a game-ending pick. Paul is deflected. Incomplete by Udifrestro. Um, yeah, okay. Nice deflection by... I'm not even going to try to pronounce that name because there's no way I'm getting it right, but that's a nice little play. Third down coming up. <clears throat> a minute eight left. <clears throat> a minute eight left. Huskies look like they might be bringing a little pressure. Uh, no, three-man rush. Over the middle, almost intercepted again. Great couple of plays by number 48. Wow, he deflects two passes in a row to bring up a fourth down. Uh, one minute and three seconds left. One minute and three seconds left, fourth down for the Beavers. Let's go, guys. Isn't 48 Bud Dupree's number? That's kind of what I'm thinking when I'm looking at this guy. Makes me think of Bud Dupree. Husky's bench is jumping up and down. Okay. Okay. Fourth and five, three receivers. He's got the snap, four-man rush. He's looking. He dumps it down. It's deflected, intercepted, and that will do it, guys. Washington picks it off. He didn't need to pick it off. He could have just let it hit the ground, but he gets the interception. That'll do it. That'll do it. The game is over. Washington needs to take two knees to end this one. Nice. Series of plays by the Huskies, number 48. He deflected three passes in a row. And on that one, the ball bounced. Oh, no, he bounced off his own player. And number 20 on the Huskies brings it in. All right. So we're going to have a couple kneel downs in a second here. 
No problem, username Mikes. Please sub to the channel if you like this. I might do this every week with the Huskies. I might do a stream for every game with the Huskies this year because we're only going to have five games or maybe six, maybe seven, maybe eight, but probably not. Okay, first kneel down is down. All right, one more kneel down and the game will be over. So quick thoughts on this one. We got a lot of good running backs on this team. We got to clean up the penalties on the offense because they're the only thing that is stopping this offense. Receivers need to catch, although I think the weather had something to do with that. Uh, Morris played okay, I think. I don't have a problem with what Morris did tonight. I think he showed me some defense. Defense was kind of embarrassing for a lot of that game, but when they needed to make some plays, they did. We um, – The game definitely turned on that fourth down stop that didn't really look like a fourth down stop. I can admit that. But uh, <clears throat> at the end of the day, both teams kind of did the same stuff. They ran the ball a lot and couldn't really stop the other team from running the ball. Okay. So anyway, oh, David, I didn't see you there. Welcome, my man. How you doing, David? No problem, guys. I will be posting a post-game video a little later. I know I don't get very many hits from my Huskies videos, but I will be posting a Husky post-game video shortly. Uh, all right. Any? All right. So I think there will not be a video game stream tonight, guys. Uh, yes, yeah, short. This the stream will be archived. So... Um, I think it's actually a little too late. I'm probably not going to do Dragon Quest tonight. I'm going to go ahead and do a post-game video for this game, and I'm going to call it a uh, night at that point because by the time I'm done with the video, I'm done with my errands, it's going to be past midnight. So I will be keep an eye out for a post-game video in a little bit or watch it tomorrow morning if you want to. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. But uh, this was fun. I might do this again next week. We'll see. But uh, peace out. Go Hawks. Go Huskies. Bow down to Washington. And, uh, yeah, see you guys later.